Good afternoon and good evening. I'm having to do an intro from my phone as uh, the external hard drive set off, the um, memory card, this SD card is in the laptop. The video is currently being edited together and sorted out and I didn't record an intro again. So this is our no two takes. <laughs> this is our Halloween Bonanza uh, donut video. Um, the first one is talking about uh, stone ground donuts, and we're going to end off with M&S donuts. Uh, and that's it now. We're done with donuts until at least Christmas. <laughs> um, as much as we love our donuts, we're going to take a bit of a break. Um, we found out, obviously, th this is going up late because we've had to like scramble uh, with things going on with what's happening in the world. Um, we've had to change things around and then this just fell onto the back burner, but I don't want it to be on the back burner for too long. So I'm going to, um, edit and post this, uh, tomorrow. I'm going to edit it now, post it tomorrow. Um, which would be Tuesday. And if I ever watch this back in the future, I'm going to go, Tuesday the what? Who knows? Uh, but happy Halloween, everybody. Um, the flat's still decorated for Halloween. I don't remember if I uh, ever showed anyone the flat decorations. Um... But yeah, the flat's decorated for Halloween. If I ever do watch this back, uh, that spider web in the corner, I really am a big fan of. Um, so yeah, anyway, um, I hope you enjoy these uh, this donut video. There's a there's a group of us in this one. Um, yeah, so we hope you enjoy this. Uh, have a, a, I hope you had a very ha happy Halloween, and we will see you again uh, in the next. There's a bit of a crowd in this one, so we've had to go for a weird angle and a weird way of filming it. It's going to be very different to the other ones. Um, Millie wasn't there for the Krispy Kreme donuts, but she's also... Have you tried Stone Ground before? This one. Yeah. Yes. You might have to speak a little bit louder. The camera's further away from you. <laughs> yes. yes. <laughs> Vocal projection. Vocal projection. Um, yeah, so we've all tried Stone Ground before. <clears throat> um, you weren't here for the Halloween Krispy Kreme ones. We've told you about our Krispy Kreme oh, no, experience. Um, we're not talking about Krispy Kreme. Um, so the first one was uh, Spider. Uh, there was an Oreo in the middle of it, which none of you got because it was soft. <laughs> so I took it off. <laughs> um, what did you think of Spider? Was it meant to be flavoured? No. <laughs> I don't know if any of them are flavoured. No. You had a sixth of a donut. <laughs> She said she's full. <laughs> um. First and last donut your video you're doing. It, what was the other two called? Oh one was um, spider. spider. One was spider's web, spider's and the other web. one was monster. Uh, monster, I think. Okay. So that one should have had gummy teeth. That took those off as well. Okay. So spider. Just to be clear. Spider tasted like spider's web. Spider's web tasted like monster, okay. and monster tasted like spider. Okay. So they all tasted the same. <laughs> Two tasted like chocolate donuts yeah. and one tasted like an ice donut. Yeah. Right, so one thing, this one might be a little bit quicker because they all just had different designs. They just and tasted very similar. Yeah. It was just the design. On this one, it wasn't it flavours. Wasn't, yeah, it wasn't a flavour like, it wasn't like chocolate orange. So, yeah. It was, it was just, this is a Halloween design donut. Yeah. yeah. Um, so the two, um, the, the monster and the spider cost me 50p more each. It had a, because it one had gummy teeth and, and one had the sweets um, and stuff on and the Oreo. And the Oreo. So and I'll tell you this as well. I had an eye for the, from the spider. Yes. Bloody hurt my teeth. Mm -hmm. And then I had, I think it must have been like the nose or an ear or something. 
a little gold thing. If I remember during uh, the editing, I'll try and clip it so you can. I want to see if we can hear it because I was stood by the camera and I could hear it echoing. Yeah. It was a loud. It was a loud crunch. Yeah. And yeah, it was like a loud crunch, and yeah. it like got in the back of my teeth. It was rock hard. So uh, we've only done the the um, Halloween donuts. We've tried the other ones before, but it was just ones that we wanted to try. And so we're just group of us. We've all been pumpkin picking, which you'll see that video for. Uh, we thought we'd treat ourselves some donuts afterwards, but we wanted to try the Halloween ones. Um, that box cost us eight pound fifty for the six. Whereas Krispy Kreme for the three. Uh, and a box of the mini bikes was eleven. I think the quality in Stone Ground is so much better than Krispy Kreme. Yeah, yeah, it um, is. I don't feel sick after eating. No, no. Like, I know for a fact. There was no herby taste. There was no what? There was no herby taste. No herby taste. No filled, which you okay. are a big fan of. Um, not yeah. having the filled. It's just easier to eat. I don't feel as stodgy afterwards. They no. taste. They're like. They taste like seaside ones. Yeah. I personally prefer their little designs as well. It's probably good you missed the Krispy Kreme one then. I probably won't eat it. I won't eat Krispy Kreme. No. But would you eat more of those ones? Yeah. But I wouldn't pay 50p extra for them. Because of the design. I think that's fair. Yeah. I'd just buy a normal one. So what would it influence you to pay the extra 50p? If it had flavour to it. Okay. Because it's just the standard stone ground donut. With a decoration You're just on top. Yeah. Not, flavor I, of food. not to be an arsehole about it, I could pay 50p for Oreos, a packet of Oreos, and stick it on top of my Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. I'm or with cables. you. Yeah. And cables, yeah. So, yeah, the cable wasn't, wasn't even that nice. So, I think it's like, you know, if it was a chocolate orange taste, obviously, keep going on about that. But yeah. if it was a chocolate orange taste. But it's, it's an orange colour on a chocolate donut. Oh, yeah. a pink, oh, that was actually a purple donut, to be fair. I thought but it was, it was an orange be colour, like, so you think it was like purple. Yeah. Okay. Oh. That would be nice. Yeah. So, out of, out of <laughs> yeah, 10 nice. donut holes, as I've decided again, <clears throat> this could be the correct or incorrect way of measuring it. Is it is 10 now, I think. It's 10 now. Uh, what would you give this one out of 10? Considering I gave Krispy Kreme a 5. I, I gave it a 4. Well. I think you gave it a 4. I think I gave it a 5 as well. 5 or 6. I think, I think I'm going to give that an 8. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the only reason I wouldn't give it 10 is just because there's no Halloween-ness to no. it. It's just a design to get people to buy more. Are we basing it off the fact that it's a Halloween thing? Or We're judging it as a Halloween donut because we've, or we've already judged it as a stone ground as a company. Yeah. So this is just the Halloween section. Oh, if we just go to Halloween, it's like a one. Oh. Okay. There's, there's no Halloween. The trip. quality of the donut is like a seven, eight for you. Yeah. But the actual Halloween. Just... Did you see it before he cooked? Yes, I did. Because the thing is, Halloween, okay, so, oh, because there was no flavour, but what is a Halloween flavour? Orange is Christmas flavour. To me, that's Halloween. Orange, because of the pumpkin. But they're not flavoured, period. But so would, if it was a pumpkin flavoured donut, would you buy it? I don't know. I don't know. I'd buy it for the video. But, yeah, well, yeah, for the video. So, Ralph, if you're listening. Um, I preferred mm -hmm. their design. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. The design's are so much better. Yeah. But... What I'm saying is that... And they taste it better overall, yeah. so how can you score them lower than... Because there's no... To me, there's no Halloween-ness to it. Because the the one from... The, the Frankie one from... The one that blood spurted blood, out of it. Blood spatter. Yeah, that's Things fair. like that. Um, there's almost that like bit more effort. But Stone Ground don't do filled. Yeah. No. No, but like... I don't know. I like, can see what you mean, mean, but it's sort of like grading on a curve, just because they don't fill their donuts so there's yeah. no blood. No, it's not. It's not. Uh, there was blood. just nothing. It was just, it was, that's more aesthetic. More, yeah, that's more of the. You know, the decorations are nice, but yeah. it doesn't add anything to the no. donut. Okay. Which is, I yeah, think, that's, one I mean, yeah, that's fair. Yeah. I cannot. I just can't, in my heart, give them a lower score than Krispy Kreme. No, I just I can't so. because but I would never go and buy so Krispy Kreme donut again, Ollie's, like a Halloween donut. Ollie's thing would round out about a six if you added the two scores together, because yeah. minus the one no, from the box from the Krispy Kreme's taste was like a four. Yeah. And the, but the, the Halloween decoration was like a six. Okay. So we're at a five. Yeah. Um, but then the stone ground decoration would be like a two. Okay. And then the taste was like a like a six, seven. Okay. So, so yeah, you're yeah. about the same. Yeah. What would you go? See, uh, hmm. Because it... I'd go... I'd say a seven. Okay. 
because like I say, I would never go back and buy a Halloween donut at Krispy Kreme. No. However, I'd probably go out tomorrow and buy another Halloween donut because they taste good. Yeah. Yes, okay, they're not Halloween flavour no. or whatever, but they still taste good. Yeah. I just find there's I'd nothing eat that again. about them. Yeah, that's what that's what. But that's then what I'm for saying, me, yeah. with Halloween, I'm all about the aesthetic. Yeah. Oh, so as you may be able to tell from they, the flat, I can't tell from the angle. They look cute. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, they're Halloween. They look cute. I would buy those for a Halloween party. Yeah. I'd so for me, I'd score it higher for that. But yeah, that's I do the my same. Personal. I would do the same. Okay, so what score are you going for? I well, I gave it a Krispy Kreme a four. Mm -hmm. No, three, four. Three. I think you gave it a four. Um. So I give this a five or a six. Okay. That's fair. Just because I like, obviously, I like the donut. Yeah. But there's, like I say, there's nothing. Yeah, the quality of donuts mad, is like mad Halloween. Yeah, about. yeah. This is a higher quality donut oh, yeah. in taste and everything else. It's just the design and the. Yeah, that's what's lacking for me. Yeah. I it's feel like you'd be a little bit less harsh on it if it wasn't an extra fifty p. Yeah. I can. I feel that, like I think that's fair. I yeah. feel like because mm -hmm. there's no, there's no, the Oreo. Uh, yeah, they have to outsource it or whatever. Yeah. But. It's there was no reason for it to be fifty p extra. No, it's just it's just the whole Halloween. Yeah. No, I get that. Um, but like, because you got to think like with the Krispy Kreme ones, the reason that they are fifty p more or however much more they were, yeah, is because they've done a complete new design for them. Yeah. It's not like they've just gone, oh, here's a donut, and we just stuck an Oreo on top of it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I get what you're saying. Do you know what I mean? Like yeah. they've gone, okay, we need to we need to put a thing that looks like Frankenstein on it. Mm-hmm. Or a wolf, or yeah. whatever, where they've gone, this is my eyes and your teeth. Yeah, yeah, I get what you're saying. What would you rate it, Thomas? Uh, I'd go with the same, same, same numbers as you. What do you say, six, seven? Yeah, uh, it's five, six. Five, six. six. I'd go about the same. I'm with you all. Same, uh, the donut's great, uh, but yeah, it's not really. It's not, it's not Halloween y, is it? It looks cute. It's going to sell a lot to kids, yeah. but there's no flavour to make it yeah. taste different for the extra. I know the sweets are on there for the extra, but I prefer the taste to change instead of the sweets on top. Yeah, I agree. Because um, we haven't even eaten the gummy teeth because everything else has been... Like, the, the Oreo's already soft. Oh, yeah, I, same. Really I good. only bought these five hours ago, and the Oreo Oreo's already soft. I don't want to know how the teeth are. I think it's not worth the risk. Oh, whatever I right. Put a flavour in it instead. Yeah. Mini? Yeah. I can't obviously compare it to no. the Krispy Kreme. They were gross. Yeah. I could put some herbs on this one if you want. <laughs> <laughs> probably still taste a, a six. A six. Nice. Any other points? I just I feel like they should have just done a flavour. Yeah. On with you. Do a flavour next time. And that, that's <laughs> the only thing. Obviously, I think they do them in store. Yeah, I think they make them there and then. Um. So obviously it's a bit. But even flavoured icing. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I'm with you. It's almost like you're paying 50p for just some like icing decoration, which is understandable, but you'd think it, the icing would have something more. You're paying for a normal day. So yeah. the one that hadn't got anything cut on, just the iced one, that wasn't 50p extra? Yeah. No. But but the other ones, are, I'm guessing, are just because it had toppings. The one with and the one with the Oreos. Yeah. It's just not worth 50p. No. Yeah, because I suppose those are toppings that they don't normally have. So, yeah. they've, bought so they've brought them, them in. So they're they're yeah, so they've outsourced yeah. these new ones and sort of gone. Yeah. But I think they did alright, but yeah. yeah, I'm with you all on that. Um, so, any more Halloween donuts we find, we will be doing them. Uh, we keep talking about doing the little one, there's yeah. never any in there, so we um, can't do that. We've got, we, a few we've got some in ours, so we might pick them up for you. If we do, because we won't be seeing them tomorrow, if we do that, I'll tack that on the end of this one, and we'll double, we'll double bumper this one, because that'll be all the Halloween donuts I think we'll find in the area. Hope you enjoyed this, unless we do the next one, and we hope you enjoyed that bit, and we'll see you again in the next one. That's good. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> bye. Right. Carry on, pandemic now. Also, um, pandemic. Big Sorry change of plan. Bye. We're not going to Lidl anymore. I've heard a rumour about uh, M&S doing these new types of donuts, and I'm going to check out to see if they're doing anything Halloween related. And if they are, that's the place we're going to get our donut from. Um, that obviously we were talking about doing a little donut 
But uh, then we found out about the fact that there was this... I've, I've known about these yum nuts that uh, m and have been doing. They're on my radar, and uh, I thought this would be a good opportunity to try them. And it turns out they were doing a Halloween donuts. So, I'm going to... We've been talking about these as, like, two different separate things. Like, as a, as a donut and a, then as a, um, a Halloween donut. But this... This needs judging on two levels, so I'm gonna I'm gonna break it down. We're gonna start as a, as the donut itself first, then we'll talk about its Halloween stuff because obviously mm -hmm. this is a new review we've never done um, M &S yes. before. Uh, so what do you think? I really like them. Okay. But I am I am a massive so a yum nut for anyone who is confused. Yes, because I didn't actually look into this. <laughs> a cross between a yum yum and a donut. Ah. So they're a yum yum. Okay. Yum -yum. Um, so now we have tried cronuts, yeah, which was a croissant donut. Yeah, and this is a yum yum. And donut. this is a yum yum donut. Okay, okay. Um, I am a massive fan of both a yum yum yes. and a donut. Yes. So mushing them together, mm -hmm. uh, really works for me. Big fan. Um, much nicer than the cronuts. Yes. Um, good. They're not too stodgy either. No. I thought that they were really light. Um, it was a really light donut. Still a ring donut, like, so I, no yeah, I felt like I could eat a good couple of those before I started feeling stodgy about it. Donuts usually, I don't know about you, but donuts usually I can eat like maybe one and then I'm like... Phew. Whereas I feel like these, these could be built for more than one in a sitting. <laughs> they should not be. Uh, and I probably would res resist the temptation, but I could eat more than one for definite. Yeah, I very much like them. Mm -hmm. So would you would you go back for more? Because the thing we've toyed about with the M&S donuts is the price, because it's M&S. Um, so, yeah, what would you go back for the price? How much was it? That single donut was £1.35. And then in the... Okay, so then in the set... 5 50 or 3 No, 50? so it's 3 for £3, pounds, 6 for £6. Pounds. Okay. So they're a pound each, so you get 35p off okay. the donut. Yeah. I, yeah, I'd 100% I'd pay a pound for them. Yeah. I'd do, I think I'd do the same. I'd, I'd pay, well, I'd pay the one thirty five. Yeah. But if we were getting any more, obviously we might as well get the mm -hmm. packs. It's a nice little change to have. So in Southampton, then that knocks Krispy Kreme down to the third. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Stone Ground. Probably, actually. M &S. We've never Krispy, well. We've never talked about these on on uh, video, but we have talked about doing them as a video. I'd even probably put them below ones you get in like supermarkets. Krispy, Krispy Kreme. Kreme. Mm. Because yeah, I'd probably. I'd then sit uh, if I was considering buying donuts and I didn't want to pay the price of Krispy Kreme or the price of the other places, I'd probably just consider getting like a pack of five ring donuts for a quid instead of going to Krispy Kreme. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Or if like we don't eat these very often, as no. it may seem like we eat these every week, but if we like wanted a donut, but like we'd recently had one of the other ones mm. and wanted something different, I probably still wouldn't want to go to Krispy Kreme. Like, we were talking about this in the video, after the video, after the um, Krispy Kreme video, I think, but after the, the one we filmed with Millie for definite, uh, the fact that we only go to Krispy Kreme now for the videos, uh, not by not no, by, not by choice, We uh, wouldn't per walk se. past Krispy Kreme and be like, oh, should we pop in no. and get one? Whereas the second we got yeah. back here from being in the lockdown and stuff and we walked past Stone Ground and we could smell it, it's the first thing that we thought about doing. Um, and before we did the Halloween video, we have been to uh, Stone Ground uh, in between times, but we've not done anything like that for Krispy Kreme. <laughs> um, so out of ten donut holes... Eight. <sighs> Give it a solid eight. Okay. I'm around a seven, eight, to be honest. That's the most unprofessional thing. Um, I'm around a seven, eight with that as well, to be fair. These are really good. I love yum yums. Uh, and didn't know that really was the thing. It, yeah. So I'm glad. She, I'm glad you're. But <laughs> there's a reason Beth's involved in these because I don't pay attention to shit like that. They are very tasty. Now, as a Halloween donut, what did you think of this donut? I mean, again, it was just some icing with some icing. It's very cute. Um, as a child, if I was a child, as I am a man child, and I saw this and went, "This is happening today." Yeah. Um, <laughs> basically. Um. 
as a child, I can imagine people, uh, I can imagine kids being like, yes, 100%, I've got to get this, mum, get me this. It was cute, but I mm-hmm. don't know that it screamed Halloween at me. No, I didn't know it was a mummy. No. So when I saw them, they're all different, like, um, toppings and stuff, and then that one had eyes, and that's the only reason I was like, that must be Halloween related, what is it? Oh, it's a yummy mummy. Okay. Oh, so the stripes are like a mummy costume. And I was like, this is really weak, but we really want to try these yum nuts. <laughs> um, was the icing, out of interest, was it flavoured to you? No. I can't decide if it's just a white icing or white chocolate. I think it's just a white icing. Okay, I might look into it just out of interest for my own benefit, which will not go into the video, because uh, I will forget to edit that in. Um, so yeah, it's pretty much just a plain yum nut with icing. Eh. They didn't charge you any extra for it, so I can't not I can't no, mark them down on that. I mean, uh, like, like you say, it was it was cute and all the rest. Of it, mm-hmm. but it didn't scream Halloween. No, it didn't scream Halloween. I would probably be a bit racked off if they had charged extra for yeah. that. Yeah, that's uh, as far as I know, it's the same price. There's as the rest of more it. on some of the others, which yes. are the normal flavors, than there was on mm-hmm. that. So I'd be like, well, hang on, why am I paying more for less? Yeah, but they haven't done that. No. Um. So yeah, it was cute, but. For the Halloween side of things, no, not, wasn't much not, of Halloween. Uh, they're not. So ironically, as much as we keep complaining, the Halloween actual Halloweeny donuts are the least favourite donuts we've had. The ones that tried with flavours are the least favourite ones we've had. Mm. Um. Oh yeah, I agree. It was just a little bit of a pattern, but it fit the theme, so we tried them, and I'm glad we did. Mm-hmm. Very good donuts. I'd recommend trying these donuts if you have not already. Uh, because a lot of the places we go to are very much, we've only got a Krispy Kreme, we, we can't go to Donuts, and we don't have a stone ground near us. Well, you've definitely got an M&S near you, and I think you should try these. I think these are very good. Um, but yeah, not very Halloweeny. So, thanks for trying, but in 2021, we want proper Halloween yum nuts, please. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you again in the next one.